So here's the battery pack from the Moto Tech skateboard. This you can kind of see here. Um, actually has a nice little setup. It's got these pins that clip into holders that are um, then bolted to the top of the skateboard. Uh, the downside is this thing does weigh a lot. So <laughs> I'm gonna be replacing it with a lithium ion pack. I just wanna show you guys this. On the left is the new 10S 6P um, battery pack that I built for my MotorTech electric skateboard. On the right is the stock setup. Um, as I showed you, there are some connectors, really nice setup on how it connects to the board, um, but just don't need this much weight uh, in this space. So um, all in all, this battery cost me about $75 to make, minus all the tools and things that I bought to make this. But again, this isn't gonna be my only battery project, so I thought I would invest now. I ended up finding a bunch of battery packs um, online that I was um, gonna re basically reclaim the 18650 cells from. So I'll be building some more stuff. Uh, next project's probably gonna be a electric go-kart for my son, I'm replacing an old um, gasoline motor in, in the go-kart. So anyway, stay tuned. I'm gonna go ahead and see if I can fit this battery into this, uh, this area and uh, wire it up. The new battery fit in the existing case quite nicely. Again, here are the old lead acid batteries, and there is this. One lead acid battery weighed about the same as my lithium ion pack, so I'm hoping for a lot better performance, obviously a lot lighter weight, and uh, I'm gonna go give it a test drive. 